Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a show and tell of all of my hand dyed fabrics by Stephanie Fabric. I have 26 pieces of her fabric. Most of them are fat quarters, which is 18 by 26, but I do have a few smaller pieces that are a fat eighth, 13 by 18, and two I think I have even smaller than that because I had cut them for specific projects. So we're just gonna get right into it. All of these are 28 count Lugana. This first one is Briar Rose. Then you have dried thistle. This one is a really beautiful neutral fabric. I'm looking to see if it's catching it accurately in the camera. Yeah, pretty much. This one, Melody. You guys know how much I love this fabric. This one is Caramel Macchiato. This is a great neutral also, like a light tan. Now you have to remember that Lugana for even weave dyes the lightest. Joblin will dye darker and so will Ada and Linen. This is Seaside, really beautiful white and teal and blue and there's some tan thrown in there. This one is Moana. I'm a sucker for those blue fabrics, I'll tell you. This one, Imp's Playground, green and purple, perfect for a Halloween piece. I would like to do something in black on this. I think it would look fantastic. This one is Sassanac. I'm pretty sure I pronounced that right. This is a color that she made based on Outlander. This is a beautiful neutral also. This one is called Odyssey. It's like purple and blue and white and really, really pretty. I have no clue what I'm gonna stitch on this, but Really love this one. This one looks very similar to Imp's Playground, but it's a little lighter. This is called Enchanted Glen. And I'm actually going to stitch a Halloween one on this, an ornament. This beautiful one is called Soaring Dragonfly. Very bright blues and purple. This one is called Daybreak. Very pretty pinks and purple and blue. There's blue in it too. This one is called Discord, bright blue. You see, this reminds me of DMC 996, 995, those electric blues. And then you have some purple in there too. Told you I'm a sucker for those blue fabrics and purple. This one is called Cotton Candy. This one is Nimue, really beautiful. I love this one. A mermaid who, that is not purple and green would look really great on this. This one is called Lady of the Lake. This one is Raspberry Lemonade. This one is Ocean's Tide, another beautiful blue tealy fabric. This one is Breaking Dawn. This one is Secret, and I really love this one. This is gray with some pinks thrown in and a little bit of white. Really, really beautiful fabric. This one is Sailor's Delight. And this is my last one of the fat quarters. This is Purple Pansies, another beautiful piece. Now, like I said, I have a couple under here that are smaller whoops got hung up here okay this is april showers this is one of my favorite fabrics of hers a really pretty blue teal with some pink thrown in this one is jello shots now this is the one that i'm going to stitch that stony creek welcome to my web on i think it would look great on here this one is fancy flamingo a bright pink I'd actually gotten this for that ornament that was the dragonfly ornament in the Just Cross Stitch ornament issue that just came out. The dragonfly is mainly in white, and I thought it would look really pretty on this. And then finally, this is Kaleidoscope. I had cut this for the Glendon Place 
Halloween issue project. The it's like monsters in my house or monsters something. Yeah. But that's it. I hope that helped you decide if you wanted to order any of her fabrics in Lugana. Lugana is my favorite fabric from her. As you can see, I love her fabric. So that's it for me today, guys. As always, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below and I will answer them to the best of my ability. Thank you for watching and subscribing and I will see you in my next video.